What's up guys, Mac Tech here, welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we're starting a new game, it's called Diner Bros. Um, I've actually watched a good deal of this on YouTube, so I'm pretty, pretty much, uh, uh, keyed in on how to play it, but it's a super cool game, and I figured I would actually finally check it out myself. If you guys are interested, it is on sale until tomorrow, August 12th, for a dollar off. I got this for $8.99. Uh, so yeah, it's on sale, so if you guys are interested, definitely, uh, definitely check it out. I'm gonna be using controller today. Um, I think the game is more geared to controller. It does have mouse and keyboard, uh, controls, but we're gonna be doing controller. And we're gonna be playing campaign. Uh, we're not doing any of that easy mode crap, so let's just go ahead and get into it. Uh, like I said, I have watched a lot of this on YouTube, so I do know what to do, but again, I've never actually played it, so it will be a little bit of a learning experience and we have a customer coming in this is our tutorial restaurant so we go up to them we take their order and go back we grab a patty we put the patty on the grill and we're gonna get a plate oh i can't do it yet all right it's the tutorial i can't get ahead but that's okay um let's get our little bun it's making me put it there all right bun all right this is this is not the intuitive way to do it but uh, we will follow the tutorial. The cool thing about this game, and obviously this game is often compared to Overcooked, which, by the way, guys, Overcooked 2 uh, just came out, and uh, I do plan on playing that, picking that game up. Right now, I am going to be focusing on this game. Uh, I'm actually trying to do Overcooked as a series with a certain someone, and I'm sure you can probably guess who that is, uh, but that would also entail uh, her getting the game. So, there's a hint. Um, anyway, the tutorial level is a bit different. You actually have to go up to customers and take their order. Uh, however, once I get into the main game, in single player, you don't need to take people's order. It does it automatically, because it's single player. Um, obviously, that makes it a little bit more difficult when you only have one person. So, uh, it's a little bit easier on single player until you get into the higher levels, and then it gets pretty difficult because uh, it gets faster and more orders and that kind of stuff. So, we just finished our first day, which is the tutorial day. Very cool. Time is up. We should get five stars. Easy peasy. Uh, you do have to clean up plates usually, but again, I think in single player, you don't have to do that. So, here we go. Uh, impress customers, earn big tips, buy new ingredients and equipment, and expand your restaurante. So, as you uh, gain levels, there's some really cool um, unlocks you can get. You can get servers that actually bring the food out for you. Um, so yeah, it's uh, it's pretty cool. So for the first time though, first few levels before we get the server, we will have to take everyone's order or uh, take everyone's order to their table ourselves, which is fine. Um, the nice thing about the first level, obviously, there's no lettuce or tomato yet, no other foods. It's just plain old burgies. So we're gonna go ahead and get some burgies cooking up, and we'll get a plate. The nice thing about this too, which is different than Overcooked, you can actually grab everything. Uh, and not have to put it down. Like, you don't, you can pick the bun up and then click the plate and it actually clicks the plate right away, which is really cool. Um, that's different than Overcooked. And again, it is a different game than Overcooked. I should not be necessarily comparing it, but that is kind of like the go-to is compared to Overcooked. Uh, anyway, I forgot. I can also grab these things from the outside, which I should probably uh, start doing. We have 30 seconds left, so we'll put more patties on. I don't know if we'll, we'll get to them, but let's at least get a few more burgers out. Um, and, yes, so, I did want to say, um, oh, do I have another one? Oh, I didn't give it to him, there we go. Um, this week I am actually dog-sitting for someone, I will be staying at her house, so I won't be able to stream, um, this week. Uh, I'm not, you know, able to come home, I only live about ten minutes away from her, uh, however, I need to really stay at her house. She has four dogs and a cat, so, she actually has five dogs and a cat, but one of the dogs is gonna be away, so... Um, I'm gonna obviously come home, feed Stella and all that kind of stuff, but I will be spending the majority of my time there. So the reason I'm trying to get this game out and the series started now is, hopefully, I don't know if I'll have enough time, but I want to do a lot of pre-recordings and try to get an episode of this game out every day. That's the goal. I don't know if I'll be able to record that much, but we'll see. We're gonna go ahead and buy tomatoes. We're gonna look at our quests and, all right, here we go. So, uh, serve 30 customers, finish one day with five stars, which we already completed, finish four days with four stars. We already completed one. And impress the food critic after those days. So, uh, once we impress the food critic after all the other uh, parts in that quest, we can unlock the restaurant expansion, which is super cool. Bigger restaurant, more equipment. Yes, I know how to, to, to tomato. I know how to, to tomato. Uh, one of the coolest unlocks that, I think it's, it's a little while away, but you can actually pick up two ingredients at once, which is super, super helpful. So, we're gonna go ahead and get some of these buns all ready. 
Um, uh-oh. Okay, so I've been having an issue where my monitor goes black. And that just happened. Not the best situation. But let's go ahead and get these burgers out. My monitor is black right now, so I can't really see. If you see me running into random shit, that is why. I really need to figure that out. I don't know if it's because, like, my computer's getting too hot. But anyway. Um, let's go ahead and just get some tomatoes chopped up. Just so we have them ready, you know what I mean? We don't have any other customers right now, so we should be good. Take these burgers off. We have a lot of burgers cooked up, so that's actually really good. The nice thing about the beginning levels, too, is you always know you'll need a burger. Like, later on, there's gonna be chicken and fries and shit, but right now, we know what we need. So we can actually go ahead and just get burgers ready, which is very nice. Let's go ahead. You want a plain old burgie? Come on out, buddy boy. Let's go ahead and get a, another one on a plate. And you want a, a tomato, so let's get you a tomato burger. Give that to you, my dude. Let's get some more burgers. Oh, actually, we don't have much time, so let's go ahead and just grab a tomato burger. Oh, okay, so I do have to pick it up after everything's assembled. That's good to know. There you go, my dude. All right, can you not push me, though? Um, another thing we have to uh, look out for, which is, I don't know when it's introduced, but there will be certain types of people. There will be construction workers, there will be joggers, and each customer... Uh, has a different, like, um, I don't know what to call it, like a different little trick to them, so we have to be aware of that. Let's see what's in the store. Uh, lettuce, okay, we can only buy drinks, so we're probably then buying drinks, because that's all we can do. Quests, we're looking good. Let's continue. Uh, I want to, I think, get this episode, uh, I don't know how long it'll be. I'm looking for, like, probably 20-minute episodes. Oh, we have drinks! Oh, I just unlocked that, right? Okay, I'm an idiot. But, ideally, I'd like to be able to finish the, uh, first food critic quest by the end of this episode. So we'll see if we can do that. Let's go ahead and grab these burgers. Should have chopped some tomatoes. I should have thought of that. So let's uh, let's get some tomatoes chopped in here. And you want another tomato. You want a blue drink as well. All right, so let's just get these burgers ready and then we'll take those burgers off the grill. We'll get the drink. We should be good to go. Uh, there we go. All right, tomato burger for you. Tomato burger for you drink for you. Enjoy your drink. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Let's get some more burgers going. So we just have some stuff stockpiled up. Tomatoes chopped. Let's get some of those up. I just like, the nice thing about the early levels is you have so much time. So you can get like stuff prepped. Um, later on, that's going to be very difficult, but we will try our, our very best. I've actually not seen the end game of this. I haven't, uh, the series I'm watching right now, they haven't finished it. So, uh, it is a campaign, so I there is an end game somewhere. Just don't know uh, where it is. Now, I think to change the drink color, you press X. There we go. You want a red drink. I wonder what's in the red drink. Uh -huh. Alright, let's get some more burgers going. We got tomatoes. We are looking good so far, guys. Enjoy your burger, my dude. Yeah. Let's get some more plates and buns assembled. A plain old burger. Easy peasy. There you go, my dude. We'll also eventually unlock Dash, which uh, it'll be very nice to be able to dash. All right, um, I meant to grab another burger. was not able to do that. Let's go ahead and grab this for you. Okay, now. And you need a blue drink. Yeah. Those yummy blue drinks, you know? Uh -huh. All right, let's grab you a regular burger. I know you're burning. We actually really need to get some... Oh, time's up. All right, I forgot. The beginning levels are pretty short, too hit my elbow on the desk guys we're killing it we're killing it we are doing well what's in the store uh okay let's get some lettuce let's look at our quests uh we need 10 more customers one more four star day and then we can do the food critic i think we'll be able to finish this first chunk uh in the first episode which is very nice so let's grab some burgers get those on the gorilla roo chop a couple of vegetables just so we have some stuff ready you want a lettuce burger that's no problem no problem at all. Let's get another burger going. Boom, 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 boom. And let's get you your lettuce burger. Get some more veggies prepped, perhaps. Get a lettuce chopped, you know. Because you want a lettuce. Alright. Guys, we're looking good. He needs a red drink. Um, this, the, I will have to say though, I, so I've watched, I'm watching a single player series right now on YouTube, and I'm also watching a multiplayer series. And it looks super fun, multiplayer. I believe... Oh, oh, damn it, heal. Okay, so there's salads. I forgot about the salads. Um, I believe it's only local co-op, but I'm not sure. It might have online. So uh, if any of you have the game, it would be fun to play with other people, but I'm not sure, again, if it's online or not. 
Uh, all right, let's go ahead and get you a tomato burger, and let's put some other burgers on the grill. We still have two minutes, so we probably do want some more stuff prepped. Um, let's grab you this a burger. There you go, my dude. Enjoy. Enjoy from me to you. All right, let's get these burgers off the grill. They're gonna burn. You want a salad. Easy peasy. Let's get you a salad. And combine the veggies. Grab a plate. Yeah. Enjoy your salad. All right, you want an everything burger. Okay, what is this salad doing? What the... Can I... That was so weird. I wasn't able... I'm... My burger's gonna burn. Nope. Got it. We're good. We're good. All right. You want an everything burger, so you want a salad. So let's get some veggies chopped in here. Um, luckily, no more customers are coming in. I was a little tight on time that time, but luckily, no more customers at this very second. So let's grab your everything burger. All right. I know, guys. You're unhappy. We'll get your drink. I got you, dude. Don't worry. I got you, man. I got you. We got a minute left. Let's grab you a lettuce for your salad. And. Good. We have time now to kill. Let's get some more. Uh, we have enough burgers, honestly. Uh, we only have 45 seconds, so I don't think we'll need to make more burgers, but I would like to chop some more ingredients. All right, you want a lettuce burger and a blue drink? Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Enjoy. We really need to unlock the server. Uh, the second I unlock the server, if I don't have enough money, I'm saving for that, because that is a huge time saver. Uh, basically, whenever you put the stuff on the counter, he will bring it to the customer, which is really, 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 really helpful. You can have that. Um, come on. Oh, is it making me... Wait, what? Oh, Jesus, it doesn't have a bond kill me. <laughs> there you go, dude. All right, well, I'm not getting that, and that's a red drink. Okay, well, whatever. We, uh, we did okay. I think we still got four stars, at least. I'm pretty sure we got five. I think if you don't lose an order, you can get five stars, maybe? Maybe? All right, so we, I think we only need to serve one more customer. Um, yeah, and then we can impress the food critic. Two more levels, and we're at 14 minutes. This might be a little bit longer of an episode to start with. Uh, okay, so these are joggers. So joggers, their time depletes super fast uh, because they're joggers. They need their food, and then they need to go, you know? You know, and they usually want salads because, you know, healthy joggers, all that good stuff. So... Let's go ahead and uh, start these salad, another salad, alright, let's grab you, and then you want a lettuce burger, you know what dude, you want a lettuce burger? You got a lettuce burger, just for you my man, just for you, chop that up, alright, enjoy your burgie, you want a salad, are you another jogger? I think you're a jogger, I think when they have the headband, like the sweatband, I think that's a jogger. Um, and yeah, and their time's going super fast, so that's that's most definitely a jogger -roo. Uh Let's chop some ingredients here. Just have some stuff prepped. Let's get more burgers on the grill. We still have three minutes, so having extra burgers would be very nice right now. And perfect, I have everything ready for your everything burger. You like the works. All right, what do you want, little white hair or red shirt? You want a tomato burger? Got you, man. Got you. Alright, there's a jogger, so we're actually going to worry about the jogger's meal first, I think. Um, and you want a salad, of course! Um, the YouTuber I've been watching actually did a really smart move. He had just a bunch of salads prepped. Um, if you- and he has the server. If you guys put a, uh, plate, like a dish, in the counter in the window there, uh, even if it's not ready, the server's not gonna take it. He'll take it when it's ready. So it's actually a good idea to have some salads prepped. Um, Let's grab a lettuce here. I'm a little behind. I know there's no more orders, but uh, I'm a little bit crushed for time just because I don't have much prepped. Um, I don't have veggies prepped. That's the issue right now, but that's okay. We'll go as we go, and I think after these two, they're actually, we'll have a little, a lull in the time. Yeah, so we'll be able to get some stuff prepped here. Beautiful. All right, let's get some burgers on. Oh, another jogger, Jesus. I thought I had time. Alright, you want a salad. Big shocker there. Enjoy your salad. You want a salad too, but you're not a jogger at least, so we have more time. Oh! Holy crap. Forgot I had burgers on the grill. Jesus. Alright, minute and a half. We're looking good, guys. Let's grab you your salad, and you want a tomato burger. I can do that. 
grab a tomato. If I get this out fast, I might actually have time to prep too. Which would be very nice. That's also good to know. If I put the plate on last, I think I actually have to pick up the dish. Alright, jogger again. So much for my prep time. You just want lettuce? Of course, I picked up the tomato first. Anyway, hope you guys are doing well. I haven't even said that. This game is so fast-paced, I don't even get to talk to y'all. Uh, but hope y'all are doing well. Like I said, I'll be dog-sitting, but I am hoping to get some of these episodes ready. And, and then the week after that, um, not school. So school starts, I think, in two weeks, maybe? Uh, but once school, once the semester starts, I'm actually, believe it or not, gonna have more free time. Um, the summer is crazy for me just because so many people are away, so so many people need dog sitting services. Um, and in all honesty, I don't love dog sitting. I don't love, like, being away from my house just because I have my cat and, you know, having to come home and feed the cat. Uh, you know, it just takes up time, gas. It's not terrible, um, but, oh, that was really lucky. I didn't even mean to combine those, but it worked out. Um, but once the uh, school year starts, people, like, have work and stuff, and people aren't really going on vacations anymore. So I will have more time once the school year starts, which is very nice. Um, if you guys didn't know, I got another job. I know I always seem to be getting jobs. Josh was like, I told Josh I got a new job. And he's like, stop getting jobs. But I do have a new job now. Um, and, uh, all right. We have the food critic this time, but yeah, so I'm working three part-time jobs and I, I'm in school, you know, starting in August, so um, even though that is a lot, it won't be as much just because I'll be able to spend more time at home, which is very nice. So let's go ahead and just get some stuff prepped. I don't, the food critic has not come in yet. His orders will look a little bit different. Oh, and you know what? I just realized, I think the jogger actually has a special thing uh, up in their menu. Um, I can't talk, sorry. Up in their, their order up in the top left, I think the joggers have like a special symbol. Also, I just realized, I didn't even know if my face cam was gonna cover anything. Luckily, it's not covering anything. Um, that would have sucked. Alright, because Overcook, the time, I feel like for Overcook, there's something up at the top? Maybe there's not, actually. Alright, I have so many tomatoes, I didn't even pre-chop lettuce, but... Let's go ahead and get these burgies out. Food critic's still not here, so we're looking okay. Let's get a lettuce chop. Just have some lettuce in case we need that. Burgers off the grill. Um, let's go ahead, we'll cook more burgers. All right, you want an everything burger. Boom, boom. And a red drinker -roo. Change that, you change the drink thing with X, just to let y'all know. And then you want a tomato burger. I can do you a tomato burger. One thing about the food critic to know also is that he orders multiple things. So he'll come in, finish a meal, and then he'll order more. Now that's the food critic, I think. Uh, is it? No, it's not. Okay, never mind. I thought it was. Um, I guess not. Let's get some vegetables chopped here. Uh, we have a little bit of time. I know I lose money, but I do want to get some stuff prepped. So, okay, that's the food critic. Um, so we just need to be careful of him. Now, he wants a salad. I do have to get this guy out. Uh, I do want to get his salad out just because I want to get the most points we can with the food critic. So he wants a blue drink. I uh, actually am going to get the red drink for this customer, though, just because it was going in the red zone. And then let's get you a, a blue a drink or root. Let's get some veggies chopped up. We have some time to kill before that lady's order comes in. Boom, and then we'll see what the food critic wants next. He wants a everything burger. This customer wants a plain burger, but we're gonna go ahead and do the everything burger for Mr. Food Critic, and he wants a red drink. All right, enjoy. Thanks for coming. All right, a plain old burgy burg for you with the blue hair. You want a tomato burger. We actually have everything ready for you. And then we really need to get some more burgers on the grill and some veggies chopped. But for now, let's just see what she wants. She wants a salad. Actually, that's kind of easy. So let's get these chopping. Get them all chopping, Aru. Uh, so yeah, Overcooked. Um, as you guys know, I love Overcooked. If you watch my E3 video, the game I was most looking forward to this year was Overcooked too. And it's finally out. And I was going to play it the night it released, the day it released, but I had work the whole day. So I was not able to, which sucked. Um, but I am planning to do it. I did have a question for you guys, and I don't know if you'll have a preference. Um, obviously, I've played Overcooked 1 on my own. I've never actually beaten it. Um, I've watched playthroughs of it from countless YouTubers multiple times over. I know Overcooked. I know all there is to know about Overcooked. Uh, however, 
Um, I've never played it either on the channel or beaten it just by myself. So I was wondering if you guys wanted to see Overcooked 1 before I played Overcooked 2 on the channel, or uh, if you just wanted Overcooked 2. It doesn't really matter. They're pretty similar games, you know? Um, just different mechanics in the second one. Some really cool additions, honestly, in the second game. But yeah, just let me know what you guys, what you guys think about this. Sorry, this episode is going to be kind of long, um, but we're almost done with the first restaurant expansion, so we should be okay. There you go, and time is up. So we're looking good, guys. We're looking good. We did it. I think we got five stars. We definitely impressed the damn food critic. 14 serve, $343. Food critic was impressed, all caps. Let's get it. All right, before we end the episode, looking at time, we should be good. We're going to get some uh, stuff here. We have enough. We can renovate the building, and we can buy the running shoes. And let's see our quest. So we finished that one. Um, complete. So food critic two serve sixty customers three days with five stars, seven days with four stars, and then impress the food critic. We got the running shoes. All right. Um, let's go to our stats. I don't even know what that's about. Oh wow, cool. Cool stuff. All right. Well, guys, we're gonna continue. Um, oh, I got an achievement, beginner chef. Now we are not going to actually. Um, Play this so let's go ahead and quit but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this first episode if you are looking forward to the series let me know leave a like leave a comment um it's super fun and that's pretty much it i'm gonna actually i think record the second episode right now i have a little bit of time before i have to leave for dog sitting so if you guys enjoyed again like comment subscribe it means the world to me thank you again for 800 subs that's amazing and i will see you guys in the next episode have a great day peace out